Welcome to this walkthrough of the June 2013 mechanics paper from the OCR Physics A specification for AS level. Question number one gives us four statements that have errors circled. See the first one has been completed for as the person. The statement says that the weight of a person is about 700 kilograms. Well, weight is measured in newtons, not in kilograms. So the correct unit or number here should be newtons. Second one here, the atmosphere exerts a pressure of about 1 times 10 to the power of 5 newton meters squared. Well, the f equation for pressure is pressure equals force divided by area. So that's newtons per meter squared, not newton meter squared. So that would be written as newton meters to the minus 2. Alternatively, I suppose you could write it as Newton per meter squared. That would be correct as well. The next one, a force of one Newton may be written as one kilogram meters to the minus one seconds to the minus one. Well, again, if we if we start by writing out our formula here, force equals mass times acceleration. Mass is measured in kilograms. Acceleration is measured in meters per second squared, ms to the minus two. So we need to replace this m to the minus 1, s to the minus 1 with m s to the minus 2. 1 gigawatt is 10 times bigger than 1 megawatt. Well, 1 gigawatt is 10 to the power of 9 watts. 1 megawatt is 10 to the power of 6 watts. So that's 10 to the 3 times bigger or 1,000 times bigger. Part B shows us how the density of glass can be determined of a glass test tube. Uh, the test tube is placed into a measuring cylinder of water and the increase in the volume of the water is noted. Now that increase in volume is going to be equal to the actual volume of the glass that's been placed in it itself due to the displacement of water. The test tube has also been placed on a balance and measured to have a mass of 1.6 times 10 to the minus 2 kilogram. Let's begin by writing our formula for density which is density rho equals mass divided by volume. We know that our mass is 1.6 times 10 to the minus 2 kilograms and we know that the volume is going to be equal to this change in the volume of water so 82 minus 75 centimeters cubed so that is 7 centimeters cubed. We need that to be in metres cubed. A good tip for converting from centimetres cubed to metres cubed. There are 100 centimetres in a metre, which means there is 100 squared centimetres in a metre squared, or 100 cubed centimetres cubed in a metre cubed. So we need to do 7 divided by 100, which is the ratio between a centimetre and a metre cubed because we're working with cubic centimetres, which is 7 times 10 to the minus 6 metres cubed. So we can now plug those values in, work out our density is 1.6 times 10 to the minus 2 divided by 7 times 10 to the minus 6, which gives us 2,000 290 kilogram meters to the minus three to three significant figures.